Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Eid Mubarak guys, I hope everything is going well with you I really miss you guys and I'm sorry that I haven't uploaded a video in so long I have just come back from Cairo and now I'm back in the US and I've been just like transitioning I keep waking up really early in the morning like 8 o'clock and I can't go back to sleep and then I get really tired like around 8 o'clock um, PM so I really have to get my sleeping pattern in order because classes start tomorrow and yeah <laughs> all right so um, I wanted to do an eat outfit of the day for you guys but um, I got really tired after a salah and I took them off and just slept and I might show you the outfit I wore but um, maybe in another video but right now I'm gonna give you my dorm tour so this is my dorm. You guys have seen it before, but I have changed the outlay of it, the layout of it. And here is the entrance. My roommate, as you know, is Layla. And then this is me, Nicole. Okay. So then this is our door. And then um, I have added a mat on the inside. So it's kind of like you're stepping into your house. And I guess it kind of prompts people to take off their shoes and then like feel the fuzziness. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so then close that up and um, back of the door. We have our mirror right here. And as you can see, I am sporting an abeya. Um, usually we had a keychain, a hook here. I'm trying to get it back. And that's where I keep my keys, but as of now, they are just dangling on my neck. So then, this is our lovely room. My roommate hasn't completely moved in yet, but then this is my side, and I'm going to walk you through. All right, so then, um, here's my closet. I have all my, not actually all my stuff. This is just what I took to Egypt with me. And then I just came back and then this is just all I have. Um, I have some undershirts I bought in Egypt and some storage space up there, iron, Clorox. And then I tried to put my um, detergent up there too, but it kept falling. Um, so then I have my belts here and my towels, some purses. And on the back is where I have my bathrobe. And also have this abaya hanging, the one you just saw, because I really realized how convenient it is to have it. Because I live in a co-ed dorm, so you never know who's really outside. And I feel like even if you're in an all-female dorm, guys are still just like everywhere. So um, I have this and I just put on whatever, on top of whatever I'm wearing underneath. Okay, and then here is my desk. Um, it's really just pretty plain, just has some, you know, designs from some animals from Uganda on top and a little um, drawer thing, organizers, my Qur'ans, and um, a lamp. And then this is my favorite part. I really changed it up this semester. As you guys knew, I had a lofted bed last year and that was just too much getting up and down those stairs and my laptop kept falling and it was just too much like imagine the heart attack i had when my precious baby fell off of like this is like taller than me this is like a six foot this, yeah this is definitely like six feet so i definitely did have a couple of um close encounters but okay, so then this is my bed. I got this pillow yesterday from Target because I kind of wanted it to look like a day bed and with the posts and everything. So I wanted to get a bunch of pillows and they're kind of rearranged from when I was asleep. But um, yeah, I have my two lovely blankets, my pink one in the corner over there and then my lovely white one. Something about myself is that like, I really like do not sleep in my bed in the general sense of the word. Like I don't like undo the covers and then like hop in and tuck myself in because like I feel like if the bed looks good, then I wanna keep it that way, you know, like <laughs> weird. So I just usually sleep with this um, thing here. And um, I wanted to go for like a different look. So um, I designed uh, the top portion with the help of Shamira's little sisters. Shout out to you guys. Um, I have some, you know, nice colorful bottles up here 
And then I have the pyramids of Egypt up there, as long, along with some cute little butterflies. Um, also, I have two bulletin boards from Money with Egypt and a fan I got in Egypt, and some cards that I got um, over the past year. And then my Sola Rug Messajada. And um, I just have decorated some other necklaces here. Um, I also like this addition because when my my bed was bunked, I did not have a nightstand. So this is kind of cute. I have my, um, what's it called, alarm clock, and then my vase that my friend Anna, my lovely friend Anna, got me for graduation. It is so precious. It's so beautiful. And I just put some flowers in. I have my water bottles, some journals, some um, Islamic textbooks. And um, this is my Quran again is in there. And then... Um, on top of here, I have, um, this is my favorite part of the room, because I feel like it's really colorful, like, you know, some, you know, childhood memorabilia with the pins in the background, as you have already seen if you watch our videos, which you should be watching. Um, some perfume, which I do not wear out. Um, <laughs> my lovely lamp. I love this lamp, because usually I feel like this light gets really harsh sometimes, so then... Um, if you just take off that big light, it has like a really nice ambiance to it, like kind of soft, you can relax and everything. But um, I'll turn it on for our intensive purposes. And then I have a line of beautiful candles here and these little candle holders my brother got me. I used to hold like uh, nail polishes and stuff. Um, I got these rocks in. Bahriya in Egypt. I think this used to be an animal, like their fossils. So that's really cool. And this mug is from my mom, which um, I got from Egypt. She requested it, but I have yet to, e like, uh, I was about to say email it to her, but mail it to her. And then I have here some accessories, hijab pins, trophies, some lotions I use. And um, up there was my little bulletin board with all of my little, like, um, headbands and hijab accessories but it is currently it continues to fall I tried to use duct tape and um, Shamira has my hooks which I'm supposed to use to hook it up with so um, that's supposed to be there so basically that is pretty much my dorm room right as of now um, it's pretty simple it's, it's spacious because when I had my bed bunked I had that desk underneath it along with that ottoman and um, another chair which is no longer in the room and it was just really too much it looked really cluttered but I feel like now it looks cleaner it looks spacious it doesn't look cluttered and there we go all right continue watching hijabi fears and hopefully we'll get you some more updates and um, I hope all is well. Kul am wantum bikhair. Inshallah, you all are well and you've had an amazing Eid. All right, bye guys.